to penises, in reference to my penis and family history. My penis comes from my genetics. My genetics come from my mother and father's genetics. In reference to any person trying to steal inches away from my penis or their tucking game is attempted murder. Like for instance, if I had a girlfriend and if she had a child of mine, this is just general information. Don't fucking play stupid because my penis size is on record of what it's supposed to be. And everybody in the country needs to know that information so nobody gets away with stealing any inches of my penis or any size of my penis reference to factual information but back to the point if I had a girlfriend or a fiance or something like that and she had a child of mine if they ever stole from my penis they would get prosecuted I'm not playing no games that's just general information for everybody to know if anybody of my own race or any other race tried to shrink or tried to steal my penis they would get prosecuted no matter what does everybody understand that role protocol is a documentation of my identity my genetics come from my mother and father's genetics not from any child's genetics of any girl I dated and a reference to the, my mother and father's estates my parents gave me the estates when I was a little boy because my parents knew that I was the only child they were gonna have my parents gave me the estates when I was not dating any girl no there is no arranged marriage in reference to my life no there is not so in reference to and my mother and father did not make no arranged marriage either and there's not ever going to be I might not ever get fully married you know I might have a girlfriend for a long time and they might have certain particular simple titles but in reference to the royal protocol in the media it is a prenup so nobody could ever m try to murder me to steal the estates of my parents or my wealth or my freedom or my status or rights everybody understands that right because that's just the way it is I mean, if I had a girlfriend, spent time with them, if I had access to my monies and things like that like I was supposed to, you know, things would be kind of more of a normal relationship of some things. But see, these government people are blocking me from everything. And the government was the ones that had to admit fault when they murdered my parents. The government has never paid me a fucking red cent. I've never received any of the monies. The government has to be sued every day. Attorneys have to be in court every day. So in reference to the information of any man or any person that tried to shrink my penis or tried to steal inches from my penis, they must be prosecuted. My penis is my flesh and blood, my anatomy. My genetics come from my mother and father's genetics, not from anybody else's genetics anywhere in the world. So anybody trying to steal my penis or trying to steal penis size, hey, if you're jealous, go buy a penis pump. If you're jealous, go get a penis surgery. If you stole anything from my penis, you're going to get prosecuted. If you tried to steal any size from my penis, you're going to be prosecuted. That's just the way it is. Now everybody needs to know that my penis was over 41 inches. Everybody knows it. Over 41 inches. And it has to be documented. It's not for sale, not giving nothing away, not giving anything away. It's very important in reference to other men. Because some other men probably got big penises. Some other men probably got 15, 20, 25, or 30 inches of their own penis. Some people might get surgeries and make their penis that big. My penis is natural. My penis is really the particular, whatever particular size it's supposed to be. If they have stolen from it, they must get prosecuted, and they can possibly get prosecuted for the death penalty. If they tried to steal my DNA and tried to claim that they thought they were me in some previous existence of their plans or their premeditated attempts of murder, their people must be prosecuted. People blocking me from my mother and father's mansions, those people must be prosecuted. I'm the only one that has legal right living at the mansions. 
of my mother and father, and that's just the way it is. You know, people out there in the world, there's if somebody's rich, they could probably build their own mansion somewhere. The Royal Protocol protects my ownership of my mother and father's estates forever. No matter what anybody has on document, no matter what anybody says, no matter what any gay obsessed freak tries to say, I'm not gay. I'm friendly with people, but I'm not gay. And I'm not a Christian, and I'm not German. And that's a fact. So in reference to people trying to play tricks on me, everything is a lawsuit and prosecution for people to go to prison. I might live a boring lifestyle in some particular ways, or I might hang out with friends or sports athletes that are friends or people that are directors or writers or producers or cinematographers or people in the media or supermodels or you know female friends. I have legal right to hang out with friends. These people trying to play these games, blocking me from my money, blocking me from my property, blocking me from my trust funds and revenues. Hey, people need to get prosecuted. That's just the facts. And I was supposed to be hanging out with an accountant. Like, I, you know, I was supposed to be hanging out, having lunch with accountants occasionally. I'm supposed to be at the companies because I'm the owner. And the deeds department and the treasury, I'm supposed to hang out with some people from the deeds department sometime. Because they're supposed to show me the documents. See, you know, when I was little, my father, uh, you know, 76, when my father died, you know, I'd been to just about all the properties, of course. I'd been to all the properties and things like that. And lived in the mansions with my mother and father. And when I got kidnapped after my father got murdered in 76, you know, I got kidnapped in the 80s. My mother had it documented. The Supreme Court has documents of it. The Treasury has documents of it. The United Nations has documents of it. And England and France and Italy have documents of it. And so do people in North Carolina and New York and some places. And it's going to be published in museums. It's supposed to be published in museums. And a reference to, back to the point, of my penis. My penis is my penis. I don't care if somebody thinks it's, oh, they think that's freaky because it's so long. They think it's weird because it's lo so long. I don't care. It's attached to my body, not yours. And I don't go around putting my dick on other people's bodies either. I'm not that kind of, you know, I'm not a streaker in particulars of things. Do not misrepresent. My genetics, my tissue, my penis size is copywritten and it's in the Guinness Book of World Records when I was a little boy. My penis was over 10 inches long when I was born. So in reference to the government man trying to play tricks, any government man disapproving, too fucking bad. You have to get prosecuted for trying to steal penises in America. And all these other people trying to play tricks, they must be prosecuted for their crimes. Roll protocols in the media forever. And individual rights and facts of law and copyrights and protection laws are very important. Anybody trying to call me stupid or crazy or anything like that? and they tried to steal my penis or they tried to steal my companies or businesses or tried to call me incompetent I've never been incompetent I've never been stupid either there's even been school teachers that have been school teachers of mine that have been in court against these government people and these government people lost in every court case but yet they're stealing the postal mail these government people they're still blocking me from being at my mother and father's mansions and I got kidnapped from my mother and father's mansions. And these people trying to steal my piano uh, concertos or my musical uh, videos or anything that I've done in business or the music industry. That's bullshit. Where's my revenues? Roll protocols in the media forever, man. And hello, athletes. Very important. Lots of things of importance. And the reference to the Treasury Department, where's my paycheck? I've been a member of the Treasury since I was born. Where's my paychecks? I haven't received any paychecks from British Intelligence or the Treasury or the Supreme Court or any paychecks from the Beverly Hills Police Department yet either. These people wanted to try to call me crazy. They were stealing my paychecks. 
They try to call people crazy if they're not German or Christian. Well, I'm not ever going to be German or Christian, and this isn't Germany. So whoever the thieves are or whatever person they are, they must get prosecuted. And if they don't have it notarized that they tried to send me things in the postal mail, and if it's not notarized that they are not a part of these other people's games of stealing from me, then they're going to be out of the companies too, whoever these people are trying to steal my wealth. I'm the owner of my mother and father's estates. The royal protocol is a documentation of that too. I'm the owner forever. It's never going to change. Royal protocol is forever. And all these government people and all their tricks, they must get prosecuted. Political positions in America are not for the activity of politicians ripping off rich people or famous people. That's not what those positions are for in government. And the laws of this country does not support political theft. That is a fact. So in reference to political people trying to steal, or political people trying to steal identities, that is criminal. And the government people trying to steal my money or property or land or freedom, those people must be prosecuted.